I'm Chloe and I am a constructed textile student in my final year and I am doing the frame trend. It's kind of like our modern day society basically, so how everything's documented or tracked and a bit sort of Big Brother A, 1984, that sort of darker side. I'm Josie and I do printed textiles, so I'm all about surface print and design. I'm doing Axis and that's very sort of surreal nature with a bit of structure, almost post-apocalyptic but still sort of soft, sort of sinuous, It's the best way to describe it. I'm Danielle Taylor and I'm doing the Axis trend for Global Colour. Well, I sort of did a lot of clever photography, you know, with the slow shutter speeds and I was dyeing some tops with my friends and I just really liked the shape it made. Axis trend is meant to be synthetic stuff that looks natural or the other way around, so I thought this was quite um, synthetic, but, you know, with all the particles, sort of, it looks natural. that's been absolutely non-stop. I've been a real tyrant because I've been with the watch saying, come on, come on, no more talking with that, which is always a good sign if you've got to have a taskmaster like me moving people on, because what it's saying is there's a lot there in the work that deserves discussion. We had the feedback from Global Colour and they were really impressed with what we'd done. I think they just wanted us to just carry on, all about trying to keep experimenting and then usually if you keep doing that you get lots of different ideas. My name is Hannah Moline and I'm a colour and trend consultant at Global Colour Research. Today we did a, a sort of mid-term, midpoint review. I was really, really impressed. There's a really, really high standard of work, some interesting materialities, um, interesting ways of using colour, seeing new things you know, it's always, it's really, really positive. Trends as a project was inspired by Birmingham City University's commitment to design and innovation and the potential of students to generate fresh thinking. The project's provided a unique platform for students, leading academics in product and textile design and businesses to work collaboratively to create thought-provoking showcases of what interiors might look like for the future. Um, since the feedback session I have developed a lot more of my woven fabric samples. When I met you last I was still sorting my loom out so I've, I've spent a lot of time sitting weaving. And then I've also been developing things off the loom that were picked up on by Global Colour. So I feel like I've come a long way. I hope I've come a long way. I'm a perfectionist, so I struggle to see things like <laughs> as they are. <laughs> but no, I think now that I've got it all out and it's all together, I'm sort of presenting. I mean, yeah, I'm pleased. <laughs>